I'm Will's patron, the fount of his power. My pet's been unruly, and his leash needs a yank. Hey, you leave my lad alone there. We had a deal, Will. I'll cut your bloody wings off. But Carlac's still breathing. I've taken more pleasant shits than you, Mizora. And at least those can be buried after. Yeah, what she said. That's no kind of talk for a lady. By the way, Carlac, Zariel sends her regards. I'll cut her wings off too. Right there. If you don't make Yorkie here. Once again, take me back to Baldur's Gate for some more. Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate 3. For some more uh, Dungeons Dragons fun. If we can stop our followers from killing each other. Thank you, Lazel and Shadowheart. <coughs> Anyway, we're leaving camp. We've wiped out the goblin village. That's a good thing. Bloody goblins. I trusted them for a second, then I got slaughtered. Any road up. I haven't taken on anti -Essel. I don't think we're going to. Right, we're right here now. We have Bladed Frontiers, hunt down Carlac. Travel through the Temple of Selun. Something else down here. Yes, what's this? Oh, that's the tea house. That's Auntie Essel's place. I'm not going down there. Uh, right. Looks like we might be heading north. If there's a way to head north. Oh, there's, I just noticed. This. I'd never noticed that before. There's a compass up there. Never onward. I wish I knew where I could sell stuff, though. But I can't cross there, that's for sure. Hang on, can I? Can I jump across there? It doesn't look that far. Hmm. What's that? I don't know, but we ain't got a shovel, so it's not going to worry us, is it? Uh, hang on. Didn't mean you all to come back here. I meant me to go up there. A little bit on the slow side, because I'm over encumbered. I don't look that far, I might be able to jump it. But go all the way to the edge. Kinda looks like my opinion. here. There's lots of dead people around, that seems like our signature. Often the dead people are us, but there's still lots of them around usually. Hang on. Range reduced to zero. Oh, because I'm massively over encumbered. What's this? Spider silk armor. Rare light armor. Can you wear light armor by any chance as a warlock? As ever. Okay, plus one to stealth checks. Stanion, what are you wearing? Leather, that ain't as good. Let's give that to a stallion. So he can boost his stealth checks. Come on. Where are we? There we are. He's also over massively over encumbered. Let's give that away. That bloody chest. Five pound. But 
I want you to drop it. I, was, uh, I guess you can't just do it the way I was thinking. Faith Baker should be with her anyway. She's the only one going to be able to use it at all, if at all. Like shield can go to her. That can go to her. That can go to her. Right, he's over in Cumber, but not Let's massively. Move. Me? I still want to sell this stuff, but I might have to just junk it. Let's sort by weight and see what we've got. Camp supplies. Oak powder barrel. Just drop some of the stuff that's relatively cheap. Still heavily over encumbered. Darian, delicious. Can you jump over there, please? Too far. What about you? Not you, Shadowheart. What are you doing? I'm ready. For a start, I told you you to do it, Shadowheart. You can jump there. No time for Danny. Right. What a day. Stallion. Bought by weight. Get rid of these cheap packs. Get rid of this as well. Is he okay to jump now? Yes. Right, made it across. No one stopped me yet. What path lies before me? I wonder if selling things in this game is just not Anything much of a else? thing. Well, that don't look too good. Uh, hyena, no, no. Uh, hurt a hyena. Are you okay, little uns? Something tore right through these people. Yeah, they saw you in this bubble for it. Beast reeks of brimstone and awful. Every breath is thick with blood. You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones Aye. and a yelp of pain as Aye. the starts to twist oh, and undulate. Uh, poor doggy, try to comfort it. Probably a bad move, but we'll Her try to comfort it. Like a rotten fruit. Ooh. Frenzy of claws and fangs. That's not good. What the hell? Kind of werewolf or hellhound or what? Wait, the other hey the what? Coming in with the rush. Right. Hyenas heading up up here. Whoa, there's a whole lot of them! There's a whole bloody lot of them! This is me, little Oren. 
Missing. Favors the fearless. Whack him with your thing. That sounds so wrong. Oh, it's a null. Oh, okay. Nulls might not be super intense. Null here. Okay. That's seven. There's another. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Ew, there's a lot of them. Not fun. Ow. Yeah, you look at that lot. Seeding <laughs> fury. <laughs> I don't want archers attacking me. Think good. Cleave. Can I cleave? That's lacerate. Cleave. Come on, that's not what I do. That's that's not right. Victor's path. Uh. That one's down. That's something. Oh, Dash coming in. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not sure what that is, but it doesn't sound good. I did too, thankfully. I took a hit, but I'm okay right now. Danny, I'll have that down in no time. Actually, it's a problem. Missed good. Uh, let's prepare. I can't because I need a short rest. Well, that's something. What about your dagger cloud thing? Where is it? There it is. They're almost down. They are down. Do some healing. Take you. No! Oh god, I hit the wrong one! Oh, that is cruel that I can hit. Ah, that is bad. Oh, I mean, I suppose it makes sense, but wow, no, no, no. They're down. Huh. 
She's down. At least they're out of range. It's why they're missing, I think. Because he's gone. Stallion. Fifty-five. Nova down. Let's reload, shall we? I should have said before jumping that bridge. Or just after. I know not to pet that dog in now, don't I? Well, although I wouldn't do it, would I? But when, yeah, the. the uh, it puts me in. Mm. It doesn't put me in an unwinnable fight, just like with Dancy Ethel. So, I'll take it that I don't know, because at this point, since it's. it's Different take on the same life. You wouldn't. No one back home will ever believe this. Time to press ahead. Goblin Brawler doesn't look like he wants to deal with it, that's something at least. Yeah, there were a couple of mistakes. Mistakes were made. Let's just put it that way, shall we? And while we're at it, go by weight. Again, that goes to a stadion. Um. go to her and we'll drop some of this stuff Distance is out. I really want that. I really wonder is it that you can't sell things? That there's virtually nowhere to sell things? I mean, I did come across one place or two places when there was a camp there, but you know, at the uh, roll. That's all broken up now. I think that might be enough. What now? Right, you are wearing. You, well, you're dropping that. You're dropping that. Ooh, handsome boy. You're putting that on. Uh. Dropping that. That should be okay, hopefully. 
Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. <laughs> Light on my feet. May you live in interesting times is a probably apocryphal um, curse from China, referring to essentially me living in a civil war. Now, as I, I say, it's most probably apocryphal because, from what I understand, it was a reference by a politician who said he'd heard it in China rather than it being directly quoted. Hmm. But I could be wrong on What's that. that? Uh, apparently, a steady on still not in the mood, sir. So, we will drop some other stuff. Can't give up now. Moving ahead. The steady and not is still not able to jump there. He needs more. Uh, drop some shields, they're not very good. Right, now he's Have down, so and we're okay well there. In it. I should mind my step. Something good here, I hope. Passages. There's barrels and stuff up here. Stuff here, so I missed it. How did I miss that? Lots of, oh no, it's collapse of wine and stuff, alright. to the wine you just got. That's where center camp. What it oh from where's what does where's let me do? Oh, you got two salts you can make. Okay, let's do that, shall we? And then you got uh, two ashes you can make. Still got a salt. Got a sublimate. You got a coating accuracy, or you got an elixir resist fire, or you got a potion glorious vaulting. Oil of accuracy. I think I'm going to skip that for now.
We will go down there, but we're going to take these on first. I see enemies. I've got a long road ahead. We'll save first. I've been able to shed some stuff. I want to do that boring stuff every time. How? A stallion. Feel their anguish. Coming in with a dash. Uh, you. Allowed to die. Take care of you. Thankfully missed. That's someone that's melee. Just trying to walk there. All right, whatever. Uh, action surge. Kind of wasted it, but then we also wasted the action so hard. Hang on. Why can't I use that? What do you mean? I just used that action surge, didn't I? Apparently I didn't. Alright, so we'll leave that for now. Will. Will. Let's have you do your daggers, your flying dagger things. Not sure that hit any of them actually. That is moved out as well. A stallion! Let's see a blade. <laughs> Got him! Why don't you fire them? Three, it's not a lot, but it's there. Uh, it's only a cantrip. It's all numbed. Uh, Astarian? No, sorry. Little Oren. It's nine. That local to him. Thus, we're concentrating on another spell to cast this. If the target was con uh, was concentrating, you heal as much the damage that was dealt. Huh? Okay. You must be concentrating on another spell. He is. If the target was oh, if the target was concentrating, and they're not, so it doesn't really matter. Oh no. Might will prevail. <laughs> Missed. Shame. Ow! You bugger! He's down. On the way. Can't give up. 
Keep forgetting that's not speed the action up, damn it. Guiding bolt. He's down. On the move. Where do I go from here? Aaron. Right, that's not working, so just see if we can fire that. And we did. Not dead, but it's hurt. There's only one. You can get in there, ready. Nothing important is ever easy. And you can fire that. Seven. Them too. Well, we took them down. A bit ugly. We take them down. What's in here? Better make camp soon. Might be a while before there's another chance to rest. Well, there's lots of chances to rest from what I've seen. But I think you mean we're kind of hurting. Pile of bones that they picked over. That's a candle. Some gold. Rib cage. Mangled corpse. What do we have over here? We have a note. I didn't mean to do that, I meant to pick it up, but never mind. Uh, where is it? Let's begin in elegant. Oh no, that's not it. What did we pick up? Let's have a look. Open letter on oppression and peacocks. Okay. There we are. Written in fury, a sloping hand. This is a letter to the editor of Baldur's Bash, a tabloid notorious for its controversial articles. Dear editor, I find it despicable, nay, diabolical. That you would defend Baldur's Gate's ridiculous restrictions regarding animals, said he. No animal larger than a peacock may gain entry. How archaic. My darling Giselle is the most well behaved bear you'll ever meet. And yet, to spend time with my child, I must summer home in Comir. I call upon the Parliament of Peers to resolve this issue immediately. The emotional and psychological well being of the people of Baldur's Gate is at stake. And I shall take this to the highest of authorities. Did it not be dealt with accordingly? Right now Giselle cries out for her father. This archaic policy has separated a child from their parents. I don't know how Grand Duke old, uh, older Rivengard lies with himself, uh, lives with himself, lies with himself. Yours faithfully, Miss R. Pickens. All right, it now we can go down here. That's true. And now we'll examine these. This must be where the feast reeks of brimstone and offal. Every breath is thick with blood. Poor thing. You hear what comes next before you see it. 
the sharp snapping of bones, and a yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. You watch old realization. This isn't the end of one life, but the start of another. Oh, poor thing. Knolls can spawn from the corpses of dying hyenas. Oh, I didn't see that last time. Now, that would give me a different thing. Um, right, well, it's vulnerable. You land a swift strike against her skull. She yelps, then goes still. As the life fades from her eyes, the knoll within her dies too. Stillborn. I was so concerned about her dying hyena that I didn't even notice the bit of knowledge it was giving us. Now that I know, I absolutely would have reacted differently. There we are. What now? Oh, we've got others? Is that what we're saying here? Why is it locked? Why can't I move? What's going on here? Temporarily gain hit points equal to its charisma. Hey. Why can't I move? I wonder if this is worth the cost. There's just a Starion and Shadowheart left, is there? Ansel in turn. Time to kill. Step quick. This is my time. And then Shadowheart. Not letting me do Shadowheart. Alright, now I can. Well, nope. A stallion. That one's down. Put them out of the mystery poor beasts. Should be it. Can't stay idle. Maybe not the best time. We are heavily encumbered again. Is there another one. Am I missing another one? Not enough movement points, it says. Dauntless. Do I detect loot? Oh, there's that one. All right. And there it is. No choice but to keep going. All right. All right, use your bow. Move on north. There we are. Let's get going. Shame about the ball things, but uh, better than being ripped apart by a knoll emerging from them.
Oh, well, gold in the pizza. Looks like we need to transfer some stuff again. Let's look at weight. Three of these crappy shields are only worth four. They're worth 16, but they're less than a pound each. Still, there's a lot of them. Probably enough to get us by. Dead caravan agent. What's a Taina? A Taina ears. For the godly folk of Faerun. I'm a dead knoll. Well, on my way. Sorry, Mr. Knoll, but uh, here we go. You are going to turn into something nasty. And it wasn't going to be pleasant for you. Looks empty. Got food here. Works a lot better if you hold down the uh, Alt key. Because rather than having to click on the object, you can click, click on the label. Hunt down car latch. Is that what we're seeing over here? Dead knolls? Car latch over here, is he? Risky. I think it's time for a short rest at least. Not fantastic, but it is a heal. Now, we've been beating those knolls. I'll look into this car latch person. Whatever killed those gnolls might be nearby. You reckon? Careful. Now we're burdened again, aren't I? Yeah, with the, these are only 16. About this loot, this layer is 14. These things are also 16, but what's heavy? Never damn worth one, drop it. Drop it. It's 40, but it is heavy. How much four pounds and only worth, only worth two, so I can get rid of that. Might need drop, I don't know. I haven't seen us use it yet though. Should be enough. And what was the other stuff I picked up? Let's sort by recent. This is Arrow of Ice. Short bow, not relevant, really. Testings. 
rib cage. Pile of bones. Only half a pound. I heard some, I'm hearing something over here. I was like, there might be something in there that's not very pleasant by the sound of it. Uh oh. What have we got going on? I did suddenly auto save. I suppose we can use these to make potions of speed now, can we? Let's try some alchemy. Uh, potion. Body is faulting. I don't really care about that. Fire resistance. I haven't come across much in Italy. There might be one, but not that much. It might have been useful over at Auntie Ethel. No, that was noxious fumes, wasn't it? Oil of accuracy. Yeah, we'll make it. Now. Food. Food, glorious food. Right. Stop over here. Pile of bones. Rip cage. Something over there. Indeed. Burrow hole. I'm way too big. Huh. Yeah. What if I lad there? Where are you? Will. Played at the ready. What if someone can quest it? Too big for a hole that tiny. That's not working. Won't let me. All right. I mind that then. We get that hole. That's not going to get me anywhere, is it? So let's go down. Time to rest. Yeah, it's not time to rest yet. Well, not only got a short spot. Everything. Now, is the scary noise in here or is it in here? Go in here first, in through the big doors. Nothing made you there at the moment. No traps, please. Oh, hang on. Who are you? Who are you? Anders, who oh, are you? Who's there? Please, keep your distance. You're welcome to shelter here, but we've grave injuries to tend to. Grave injuries, huh? What do you mean? Uh, do you mean serious? Or do you mean you've got dead people who are about to raise from the grave? Who or what attacked you? The devil. The most deadly foe we've yet encountered. We are paladins of Tyr, Lord of Justice. He sent us after an infernal being, straight out of the Nine Hells, hiding in the form of a one-horned tiefling. One horn? Then you mean Karlak, 
Archdevil's bootlicker. You know her, which means you know what the fiend is capable of. She yeah, not being nice. Countless refugees fleeing the absolute. Yesterday, she butchered an entire family without mercy. We were lucky to survive our encounter with her. Uh, where is this devil? She ran toward the river when she saw we were merely wounded, not dead. Down the hill from here. She must pay for her crimes. If you capture her, you will have served here where we could not. This is the sword of justice, blessed by Tear. I've wielded it since I swore my oath. Mm. It's all I have, but it's yours if you stop her. Bring me her head, and Tear will consider her crimes Sounds repaid. Sounds good. Well, mind a new weapon. Very well, I'll bring her head. God guide you. Oh, she's not in here. She went down to the river, did she? On the devil. Get down here. Of course it's going to disappear. She don't look at ah, is that her over there? I think it is. Running hot, I wonder what that means. Well, we tackle this, I think this is going to be a dangerous one, so let's save. I don't care if you don't like saves coming, I do. I like living. Horn, the stink of Avernus, Advocatus Diaboli. <sighs> well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. Thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. It should teach you not to. Ah, Will's a good lad. That's is smart too. You know, the devil have been hunting Carlos, right? Bloody right. An honour to be chased by the Blade of Frontiers, but I... Ugh. A great heat roars through you, her heat, fiery as the hells. Then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood. I see that. Wall. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What was that? Evidence. Proof that you're a devil. A gladiator in the Archdevil Zariel's army. I can explain, but it's a whole situation. If you just hear me out... Another vision. Karlak's blade raised, slicing through devils. Zariel's servants, as her eyes dart around, seeking escape. Her rage and desperation seep into you. She is a victim of the Blood War, not an agent of it. She's trying to trick us. Don't believe her lies. I'm curious, actually, Will. You saw the truth. I never wanted to serve Zariel. I was enlisted in her army against my will. Forced to fight, and fight I did. When I saw an opportunity to get away, I took it. <laughs> Finally home. Or near it, anyway. You served her. That's enough to damn you. I don't know if it is. Yes, down, down, Will. You saw what he I saw. He catches his breath and his lips straighten. Sheer dread twists his face. You don't know what you're saying. 
You're asking me to trust a devil. Am I? You're stubborn. Carl's not a devil and you know it. Listen to sense now. I don't want this to end badly for either of us. You know monsters, right? Better than anyone. Look into my eyes. Can't you see I'm not what you think? Shit. You really are no devil, are you? <laughs> I've been deceived. Yeah, just a bit. Oh, thank the gods. Thought I was going to have to take your head. Uh, yeah, don't try that. You might have a problem. The attempt. But there have been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye. Truce. I'm Karlak. But you already knew that. And you are... Emlet Lauren! Well met, soldier. Nice to meet a friendly around here. It's been tough going so far. I may not be a devil, but I can put the Blade's reputation to work. Okay. How would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? That sounds right up my alley, to be honest. If your moral compass needs something to point at, you already know I fought in the Blood War. I was good. Really good. It turns out I've got a knack for killing demons. That made me a valuable asset. Zariel, the arch devil herself, made me as her personal attack dog. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there. But devils don't like to lose their assets. Zariel liked it so little. She sent a bunch of goons, so-called paladins of... Oh, Kira, that lot! Back. Problem is, I'm not going. Well, they're working for them, for them are they? So you want me to hunt the people, uh, to kill the people haunting Don't you? worry, I'll lead the charge. But I could use your help. There's a lot of them and only one of me. After that, we can team up. Take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? Yeah, it sounds pretty good. Let's do it. Fuck yes! They cornered me outside the toll house just up the hill. Doubt they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. Uh, hang on though. Looks like you've got enough backup at your side. Not sure there's room for me. I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now. But don't get to any of the fun stuff without me. Got it? Well... Will wants to word to a pantomime. I'm sorry to say, and I've played my part all too poorly. Yeah, you made a bit of a misstep, but that's okay. But why don't you lay it out plainly for me, Will? Tell me what you what you know exactly. It means that a reckoning's coming, and I'll be the one to pay up. <sighs> Gods, what now? Do you have a tax collector on your tail? You're closer than you think. One night soon, when we make camp. The veil will be lifted, and I'll pay my penance. Okay. Should I be worried? You're not in any danger, I promise. I can't say the same about me. Well, all, li all likely I'll be there with you. Don't worry, I'll have... Well, now... Things have taken an about turn, haven't they, really? However, I think it's time to head to camp. We've got some injuries and stuff, and I want to have a word with our lass over there. Well, let's head to camp. And uh, I need to drop one of them out, so... A stallion, wait here while we decide what's going to happen. Uh, I thought we were going to see some real sparks fly between Will and Karlak. Well, maybe me and Karlak, you never know. <laughs> it's almost a pity things ended so amicably. Seeing those two duke it out would be fun. No, I was thinking different kind of sparks, but there you go. I think, it, I think it's better if you stay in camp for a while. Oh, darling, I'm hurt. I thought we had something special. Just stay here I for a bit. Guess I'll spend my evenings lounging here while you do all the hard work. It sounds awful. Right, now then, Carlatch. Why are we slowing down? 
So how do you end up fighting in the Blood War? Trust me, I'll tell you all about it after we take care of the goons on my tail. You know an expert opinion, what's the best way to kill a devil? Depends on the type. Ice devils hate an inferno, but that's an easy one. Orthons love projectiles. What they don't love is getting their bombs lobbed right back in their faces. Demons, on the other hand, every demon is absolutely singular. You can't ever think you've got them typed out. Sharp instincts, sharp weapons, and a knack for improvisation. That's the only way to survive them. <laughs> anyway, what were we talking about? Oh, where did I thought it'd end up? How about you? <laughs> Funny you should ask. I was just thinking about what would have become of us without that Nautiloid. I mean, I know where I'd be. Trapped in Avernus still, with the Blade of Frontiers on my tail. But what about you? I'll be back in my home, not again in the world. Having fun oh, in... Oh man, the... lucky you. That's the Having dream. fun in the arena. Maybe when this is all done, you can show me where you came from. My family home's long gone, but I'll show you my favourite chow hall in the city, if it's still standing. Not done with you yet, lass. Yeah? What about a you tadpole really pals? It, huh? Not worried about adding more illithid into the mix? Ah, we've got all guardians! Right. What can I say? You look fine, smell fine, seem fine. If you got a little boost from the tadpole, who am I to begrudge you? In fact... Got any going spare? Not right now, but we might have it in a bit. Ah, uh, uh, maybe later. If I did, would you accept you know, it? I think I would. Bit surprising, but I'm starting to see the silver lining of this whole parasite situation. Maybe later, then. I'll hold you to that. Now, are we done here? Yeah? Ah, yeah. Come on, we're heading out. Let's go, go, go. Right, now let's see what exactly she is. Making me sweat. She's a barbarian. <laughs> okay, so we got another warrior. Hmm. Not sure what you think about that. I may have to take her off with me for the... Oh, she's only in barbarian clothes. She's not got, got no armor at all. I'm not sure what I think about her. Anyway, let's end the day. What is it? You have enough camp supplies? Yes, I do. Hell's fire. She's coming. Who's coming? Uh. Oh dear, that doesn't look good. Hello! Well, you've been naughty. And you know what happens when you're naughty. God damn it. Anyone but her. Ah, oh well, well uh, you a luscious thing. You flatterer. Why, if I had a warm heart, I'm sure it would be skipping. Call me Mazora. I'm Will's patron, the fount of his power. My pet's been unruly, and his leash needs a yank. Hey, you leave my lad alone there! We had a deal, Will. I'll cut your bloody wings off! But Karlak's still breathing. I've taken more pleasant shits than you, Mizora. And at least those can be buried after. Yeah, what she said! That's no kind of talk for a lady. By the way, Karlak, Zariel sends her regards. I'll cut her wings off too! You told me! Devils only! 
She's a tiefling, not a monster! How precious. The little pupster's found his bark. Clause G, Section 9. Target shall be limited to the infernal, the demonic, the heartless, and the soulless. Karlak meets the criteria, pet. Trust me on this. I wouldn't trust you if my life depended on it. They're not lay a damn finger on Karlak. Don't you worry. That ship has long sailed the sticks. But a defiant pup must still pay his price. To wit. Oil burns in the fires of Avernus. Ooh. The lightning storms of Dis strike his flesh. His soul passes through each layer of the house, oh. gaining their essence and their torment. Oh my. Well, you're not looking very good there, mate. Oh, whoa, whoa. Actually. Damn. You've, you've improved. Look a lot hornier, too. That's better. What the hell well, have you done? A promise broken, a price paid. You know the terms. Get used to the new form, pet. There's no going back. Some magic even I can't undo. Now, let's see how the frontiers fare without their precious blade. Karlak, keep an eye on him, would you? I'll be keeping mine on you. Oh, and Will, don't forget, our pact still stands. Ta-ta. So what, you've turned him into a demon? A tiefling? What have you done? Uh. I'll be honest, soldier. I'm reeling. Will hardly knows me, but he chose my life over his. <sighs> Been a long time since someone stuck their neck out for me like that. Yeah, he's a good man. Maybe the best of us, even. You can say that again. When he was chasing me through Avernus, I thought he was just another sad merc. How wrong I was. Now, Will. Will. Alfin, can you come with us or not? Seems like a good moment to talk. You wish to speak? Well, he's not coming with us. All right, so Will. God's damn her straight back to the hells. Just look at me. I did what was right. And Mazora made me pay for it. I'd be hunting devils and demons, she said. Traitors and hypocrites, heartless evils of all sorts, but not... Not Zariel's victims. Not innocent tieflings. You warned me about Raphael, but I packed it to Mazora. What a... F no. Uh, the Blade of Frontiers, so there's some explaining to do. I can. But it won't be enough. It's Mizora who grants me the power to conjure armor and cast eldritch blasts. Before I was infected, I could even call hell beasts and summon festering clouds. But I promise you, every thrust of my blade and every flame I sparked was for the good of the coast. Well, in terms of your pact. I can't utter the terms or circumstances of the pact. I can tell you most all else, but the pact... I'm forbidden, unless Mazora permits it. But I'll say this. The moment I pacted myself to Mazora, I have not regretted for a heartbeat. It was my proudest deed. It was worth the sacrifice. All I can give you on that is my solemn word. Okay, so anything else we can say with well, him? Oh, it feels to be a devil. Oh, he's a devil, isn't he? Anyone who bathes in the river of blood emerges as one born anew. It's a lot like that, I imagine. I feel the weight of these horns on my head curling upwards like a mammoth's tusks. I feel these ridges snaking down my neck. 
Not to mention a few bumps and prongs in unmentionable places. Yeah. But I haven't seen my reflection just yet. Be my mirror. What do you see? I don't some devil if I do say so. I think it's an improvement. <laughs> I can't tell if you're being silly or serious. I'll accept the flattery either way. I suppose I'll grow used to the new me. Horns and all. The people will see a curiosity. Maybe even a beast hungry for their souls. But I will slay their monsters. Keep them safe. And one day they will see the Blade of Frontiers again. All right, there we are. Now, Will. Fiend, level four warlock. High approval there. She's got a level up. She's got high strength. The pride of the gate. Not sure he's a human anymore. He don't look very human. I'll be honest with you. Anyway, it's time to sleep. And uh, when we wake up, that'll be it for this time. What have we here? There we are, a new day dawns. Well, my friends, join us next time when we continue with uh, Little Oran going big and adventure with Karlak for a little bit. Although I don't really like having two fighters in the party when I need the others too. Uh, I'm regretting being a fighter now because... Uh, some of them I want to adventure with that kind of fighters. Barbarian and a fighter. Alright. Well, see you next time.